Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am Dr. Amy H. Sturgis, and in the fall semester of 2013, it will be my privilege to offer a new online 12-week course for the Mythgard Institute at Signum University. That course will be called Sherlock, Science, and Ratiocination. Students from around the world will be able either to take the course for master's credit or audit the course for the love of it. They will also have the choice to attend my two 90-minute lectures per week live or download them after the fact. Online interaction with fellow students and with me will be possible in a variety of ways. The intellectual sibling of science fiction, born of the same parents, the scientific revolution and the industrial revolution, is what its father, Edgar Allan Poe, called Tales of Ratiocination. Poe created the first scientific detective, C. Auguste Dupin, who in turn paved the way for one of the most enduring and beloved literary characters of all time, Sherlock Holmes. This course focuses on Poe and Conan Doyle and how their works blended scientific method, mystery, and imagination to create the modern literature of detection. We will consider why Sherlock Holmes remains an often revisited and reinterpreted character with remarkable resonance in our own time, and how the genre he helped to create and the literary descendants he inspired continue to question the idea of order in our universe and how we know what we think we know. In this course, we will encounter excerpts from the works of early detectives, read the three stories that introduced literature's first fictional detective, Edgar Allan Poe's C. Auguste Dupin, and study the first great novel of detective fiction, The Moonstone by Wilkie Collins, before turning our intense attention to a wide sampling and deep reading of Arthur Conan Doyle's Sherlock Holmes novels and short stories. The course will end by exploring the BBC's current Sherlock television series and considering what the science of detection means in the 21st century. We hope you will join us in the fall of 2013 Visit mythgard.org for more details. Thank you.